Good morning, Senrai Dalris. Hey, Sass. Am I doing in my rhombus? <laughs> Not quite. I'm feeling rather isosceles this morning. Wait, what's the ominous part? Dalris. There we go. Oh, sorry for starting again a little late today. It's been a uh, important information. Oh. <laughs> no, it always says that. It always says that. It's all, it's all good. <sighs> oh, hey. Some of the people in that scene are already dead. Radical. All right, let's hop back in it. So last time, we narrowly avoided taking place in a genocide, so that was that was nice. Feather on our cap there. Hello, Reyna. Welcome to the stream. Saranoa, making a valiant stand in defense of the Roselin village, slays Silvio Telior. Word of their disobedience reaches the Holy One, who sends an army to conquer the heretics. With the enemy only a day's march from their doorstep, House Wolfort and the do something with the Umineko fighting game? There are plans to do something with the Umineko fighting game. Uh, actually, there will be a video on the channel tomorrow. Our, we'll be doing like our Umineko post mortem tomorrow. Will be released tomorrow, and that'll have both like our final questions and also answers to everyone's questions, as well as like a breakdown of what our plans are for future R07 stuff on the channel in the future. So, look forward to that, I suppose. How to avoid dying and having everyone in either chattel slavery or everywhere. Woo! Yeah! Something tells me everything will be fine as long as we're at least level 19. Looking worse for wear, Anna. Long scout missions sure ain't easy. Easy or not, I do what duty demands. Do you need something? No. Just reckon Benedict must be relieved you're back safe and sound. Must he? Of course. After all, he treats you like his own daughter. Don't know any parent what wouldn't worry about. A breakdown of the Umineko for the PSP, Umineko for the PS3, Umineko for the 360. <laughs> Yeah. Man, I really want the Switch version of the game. With all the dangerous ah. Oh. Did you see one's the fighting one? Golden Fantasia? Oh, I have it on Steam, so. Benedict trusts me. That's all I've ever needed. That's so. Do all parents by blood show concern for their children? No kind of two is you sucker someone else into playing it. <laughs> I, I, I'm debating, like, whether or not, like, I, I should just, like, buy it on Steam for one of my friends and just kind of, like, be very pointed about it or just, nah. <laughs> I tried to sucker my own Ruby, my old Ruby into playing it. Wondering about yours, are you? That's none of your concern. I still remember how you insisted on being a scout. As soon as you were old enough, you wouldn't say why. But any fool could guess it was Very funny that the fighter only came to 360 before being on Steam, given the VN didn't come to it, but the came to PS3. Yeah, yeah. Yet Benedict refused me. And he was wise to do so. It ain't a job for an amateur. Guess he hadn't anticipated you trained under Archibald. I earned his respect when he saw what I could do. The means don't matter. They know these two are having a heart to heart, but I am like barely paying attention here. Oh, hey, Bandicoot. Minako 2, watching someone else play it. Yeah. The enemy has captured <gasps> I've also been resisting the urge to watch watch another playthrough yet, just because um, I still want to take one more crack at some of the mysteries. And I, I, 
I don't know. I also kind of want to percolate it, and I don't want to. I don't want to over inundate myself with it to the point where I I feel like it overstays its welcome. You know. Watch the anime yet? Yeah, watch the anime. I know our soldiers aren't broken easily, but given enough time in the enemy's hands. The anime is are, an experience. Commanded. I shall call a war council so our approach may be reconsidered. Which on a holy night was uh, was on PC. They refused to release the English patch on PC and instead developed console versions. Hmm. The scout has been rescued and returned safely home. Already? That was far sooner than I anticipated. I hope my actions were not out of line. No, no. Well done, Anna. I don't know where I'd be without you. Good job, Anna. Nor are you. This doesn't excuse you voting for the racism in the last episode, but you know what? <laughs> but good for you. Can't thank you enough for leaping to my scout's rescue. Oh, Benedict was still pondering what to do. Really good, like hey, specifically the Natsumi K chapters. Her take is so good. Her room show might actually know Ryukishi. That's cool. I have heard uh, Vivian is actually currently reading the manga, and she has had nothing but praise for it. So, mm. hello, Henri. Again, I won't. I don't want to talk too much about it. There will be a video tomorrow that has all of our uh, find your parents? parting thoughts. I'm not trying to dissuade you from looking for y'all. Wade, is there something you've not told me? What would I know that you don't? Just take care you don't end up regretting it. Oh, she doesn't know who her parents are. Okay. Good for you, Anna. I'm this close. Looking forward to it tomorrow? I hope so. I know it's been a hot minute. But we kind of wanted to let the uh, the ending of the game percolate, you know, for a little bit. Let it just kind of sit with it for a while. See how it felt. More character stories. Huel and Eridor embark on a hunt. The former reflects on how she came into position at the prince's side. All right. A whole day of hunting, and this is all I have to show for it. Wanted to give Lord Sarah Noah something meaty for once. A deer is no I don't know. Is Eridor like the most... Would Eridor be the best at hunting? Very loud. One deer to your three boar? <laughs> it's plain who the better of us is. <sighs> I don't reckon oh. you... Perhaps. Sorry, buddy. I don't reckon you let a single one escape. Before I was knighted, I was keeper of the hawk's roost. And besides... I come from a long line of hunters. Something meaty. That's so. <laughs> he does have something meaty for Sarah Noah, huh? Raining and thundering and lightning and tornado watch. Happy winter. Wow! All at once? That sounds awful. Lenbrook put out a call for hawk riders. That they might challenge S. Frost's aerial superiority. I answered that call. <sighs> My training was the hardest thing I've ever had to do. But I won a position in the King's Guard, where I petitioned to serve Prince Roland personally. Seeing you in action, I'm sure you could have made a fine commander. Yet you stuck by the prince. Bunch of freezing rain, snow, and thunder here as well. Ah, uh, yeah. Yes, I did. We had a lot of snow yesterday, but today has been pretty quiet. Just cold. Still kind of happy we actually have snow. Since it's been a lot, a lot, a lot of few. Uh, a lot of the past few years where it's just been like we don't even really get much snow in December. So it's kind of nice from that we still have that for as long as we do. Ruby has yet to return. I hope he isn't in danger. <sighs> What's this He's raining while I'm inside. Here it's mostly just cold. Yeah, I get that. Raining while you're inside is very nice because the pitter-patter of rain on roofs and stuff. Hand over your coin first and maybe we can Bandits? Here? How could I be so careless? I'd advise against running. They 
nowhere for you to go. Is this some? I don't know. Enough. Ronald uh, defended her. How come no one ever dies? Nah, I was just about to say, how come no one ever dies? People do die. That's what am I saying? That's not a valid complaint, SK. I'm fine, thanks to you. It's just had silly. If you not showed up when you did, I could have ended up dead. You have my gratitude. Is that your hawk? It guided me here. I was in the middle of a hunt. But your bird cried out as if calling to me. Thank heavens I did not lose that arrow. I've never known hawks to be so wild. <laughs> Roland out here admitting to almost killing Flugi. Oh my His god. Name is Flugi, and he's more than my hawk. He's my closest companion. Triangle strategy. Triangle strategy if Roland had accidentally killed Flugi that one time. It is best you returned home. Wait. <sighs> I feel like giant hawk could be could body a dude. Yeah, like I feel like if if you got a hawk that's big and structurally sound enough for a human to ride on it, that it could absolutely body a dude. It would have to be able to. Think nothing of it. It is the royal family's duty to protect our subjects. Humans are light and aerodynamic. Royal good heavens. You're Prince Roland. Forgive me, your highness. There's no need for all that stuffy formality. May we meet again soon? Yes, sir. I'll get rolling instead of just warning her that there's a bandit nearby. That's a great question. I I, I don't have an answer for you. <laughs> Hawk is smart, but not that smart. That was my first meeting with the prince. He saved my life, and for that, I shall be forever in his debt. I could settle for no less than Kingsguard. Why didn't I just pick the brigand up and dash it against the rock like birds eat or turtles? Right? That would have that would have worked. It's like Lassie, very good at getting someone else to help, so it doesn't need to. Fair enough. Come on, what you, what's that you say, girl? You had flu. You had drop drop down the well. Oh, I'm still pretty tired today. I must say, Ugh. Your display of power I don't have any coffee special. this morning, so I'm running on tea, which is not a uh, not great if you're used to coffee in the morning. <laughs> One moment there wasn't a single cloud in the sky, and the next we were drenched to the bone. The townsfolk were certainly appreciative, and that means much in these trying times. Where did you learn such sorcery? I was born with it, as were my forebears. In the far reaches of Hyzant, my people dwell, acting as shamans and summoning rain when the people cried for it. She wear a skull on? Does she have a skull on her head? She totally does. Lady's wearing a goddamn skull. Hell yeah. <laughs> you hail from Hyzant? I suppose we should count our blessings that you found your way to our ranks. Oh, time to learn more history. I bet everything will be sepia toned now, huh? Yeah. <laughs> ah, so you're Izana. We've heard tell of a witch using her dark arts <sighs> to frighten the peasants into submission. Flugi playing long game for Roland Hewitt Hewitt shippers. Nice. Last little hawk did not know Roland already belonged to Sir Maxwell. I'm gonna get this image from a hit Xmas film about Santa. I'm gonna regret clicking on this, aren't I? <laughs> okay, so... The fish looks very happy to be in the cow vomit, so it's got that going for it. Um, there's a lobster and a couple snails in the background. What are, what are these? Are these dancing diglets? And a cow that says Lacroix on the side of it. If there were might, it's kind of cut off. Fascinating, fascinating imagery, Sass. 
you told him something for happened like an hour ago. They, yeah, it's like may, maybe maybe you could ease off on the sepia tone if it's not that far into the past. We should conduct a you had not daddy enough. In hmm, the meantime, that is a take. Requested at the Hierophant's palace. Rumors from home. There are no dark arts being practiced here. And the people are not scared of me. I provide them rain when they require it. That is all. Quiet, witch. Save your remonstrations for the Inquisition. Oh, shit. Inquisition time. <laughs> Called Father Christmas where Santa's drinks spoiled milk and has that dream say Oh! The, actually, you know what? The fact that he drunk spoiled milk to have that dream sequence actually explains the entirety of it. Everything in that perfectly makes sense now. All right. Perhaps they are threatened by the sight of the common folk huddled around your warming smile. The goddess of salt is a jealous mistress. Oh, Zonda had a lover, huh? I wonder if we'll find them at some point, or if they die. It is as you said. If you well, I guess you don't get a name, so. You will surely be found guilty, and the punishment will be grave. Then what it's a bit on the nose. Yeah, it's a bit on the nose, even. Knowing that that's the context, it's like, ah, okay. Maybe you're even laying it on a bit thick. If the tentacles There's a video game based on this film for the Sega Saturn various level. What the fuck? All right. We must flee our borders and go far from the gaze of the zealots. It will be just as we promised each other. We'll start a new life together. Is that so that's coming through with the with the fucking bizarre video game sure. trivia. That matters not. Only that it is ours. Very well. Then let us meet again at nightfall. You know where. Until then, my love. I shall count the minutes till next we meet. Well then. Also, Bar just over there, just listening in a little bit. Another victim of the raising so many death flags. Well, good news. Had he never met me, would he still be alive today? Should I have said nothing and fled alone in the night? I am sorry for your loss, but you mustn't blame yourself. <laughs> it was hardly your fault. <laughs> that kind of reminds me of loss, Hewitt. And you do not know. And you know me, I'm sick and tired of loss. You could very well still be alive. Perhaps. I tried to seek him out, but there was little I could do with the church's agents breathing down my neck. They burned down his home. And his family was never heard from again. I fear the worst. I uh, could be alive. <sighs> but probably not. The goddess of salt must be named so for the tears she causes. Ooh, she harsh burn from me. to the goddess of salt. Her minions, all of Heiser, they bear responsibility for my grief. And I aim to see that they answer for Wow, it. good good thing we didn't side with Hyzant, huh? Although we have known each other only briefly, I sense a strong ally in you. Will you lend me your sword when the time comes? Of course. Of that you can be certain. Well, all right then. Let's see. What do we got next? Let's see what happens in the aftermath in the Rosellan village. Hell yeah, revenge. Revenge is my favorite. So that's the size of it. House Wolfort has gone to such great lengths for us. I mean, it's, it's not that we're going to, we go to great lengths for everyone. Alone. Your people brought nothing upon us. It is as Saranoa says. We are happy to do all that we can to protect you. Forgive me. When a lady does heresy for the sake of people and then wants to burn down the church. Yeah, yeah, that that's my that's gonna be one of my favorite genres of lady. You came to our rescue just as she did. I cannot help but feel twas fated to be so. <laughs> Doing a heresy to help the people. Screaming fuck the church. Gotta love it. 
Where did you hear of this, Jerome? I told you not a whit about her. I overheard whispers between my mother and father long ago. Why would the elders labor to keep such information secret? Uh, well, truth be told, we feared being persecuted anew. And so your greatest fears have come true. Hmm. Pray, hide no longer. And tell Lady Frederica what you know. Yay, we get to learn Frederica's uh, mother. That's actually cool. You know Let's learn about this. Of Hyzant's oppression of the Rizal, yes? Then you know of the Rizalian revolt that occurred 30 years ago. Your mother. I also let you fuck the church, too. Your lesbian dragon grandma lover. Yeah! Yeah, that is true. Three Houses does let you fuck your lesbian dragon grandma lover. Which, you know, that's, that's a sentence. She led us to freedom from Hyzant's rule. <laughs> Am I is the term grandma metaphorical? Yes, but not in the way that you're expecting it to be. Who is also your daughter? Well, not your daughter. She's the daughter of the spirit that not the spirit, but she's the daughter of like the goddess that your consciousness has melded with. So yeah, she's it's both. It's Also she's a tyrant, which is kind of cool. So, you know, layers. She even left a sizable gash upon the goddess's statue as we departed. <laughs> I don't see any fucking immortal dragon lesbian grandmas in this game, huh? The statue that stands tall in the source. I've never heard tell of this gash. Didn't we see it last time? Also, also, Frederica's mom apparently very cool. I was romance is sure weird and definitely didn't awaken anything at anyone, huh? <laughs> yeah, they didn't awaken anything. I had no idea my mother was involved with the revolt, let alone led it. And it was my father who gave them this land to settle. Sarah Noah, this isn't about you, buddy. Sarah Noah, I know you mean well, but this isn't about you, dude. <laughs> Hey, uh, SK, let me post a link. The Badians were named after real age people. Post a link. Yeah, okay, hold on. All right, you're modded. Go ahead. The rest of us, battered and bruised in the escape, parted ways with her and remained here to live out our days in peace. And so she eventually found her way to Esfrost, where she was taken in. Oh, what we got here? Oh, fucking yay! Fire Emblem Family Trees. Can't wait to look at that later. I thank you for sharing such a wonderful chapter of my mother's history. I hear she rallied the people to her cause with these words. The Holy Stave's teachings are false. The goddess's blessings spread across all Norzelia. The blessing of the true goddess. The blessing that shall be the key to the chains that bind our people. How much of this have you heard? Is Jerome going to join us now? I beg you, recite those words once more. The Holy State's teachings are false. The goddess's blessings spread across all Norzelia. The blessing of the true goddess. The blessing that shall be the key to the chains that bind our people. So there exists a key that gives the lie to the goddess. Ah, uh, we got to find a key. All right. With that in hand, we can yet confront Hyzan. What? Pray tell, good elder. What might it look like? I. <laughs> Is. I thought they were speaking metaphorically. <laughs> Is this not a metaphorical key? Okay, hold on while I... Oh, well, I almost spoiled something else. I will not do that. <laughs> Alas, I, I know not to what they were referring. But Wee like, triangles! Hi, Evie. Leia left it in this village. 
Could ever go wrong with medieval setting family tree. It's sure that coefficient is going to stay <laughs> at zero. Hey, you know, they're just keeping it in the family. That's what's, you know, family Someone, first. Please, we would speak with your parents at once. I'm afraid that's not possible. They both passed many moons ago. We must find this key, Lord Serenoa. I know it sounds like a fool's errand, but I feel we have no other choice. I agree. Tis a slight hope, but hope nonetheless. Radical. <sighs> Just like Fast and the Furious? Nice. Not this piece of information, you wouldn't really be able to do anything? I guess. Yeah, I guess. No, the keys in this village, so precisely what form it takes still eludes us. You want information? If the key does indeed remain in the village, I will find it if I must. All right. Let's gather all the cousins, write this down on a little notebook, and head down to the beach. We'll hash this out. We can get we can finish this in an evening, right? All right, where are we starting here? Let's start here with you. Hello. Whenever I look at my children, I'm reminded that we cannot bow to Hyzanta's demands. Yeah. Got an email talked about the Traveler 2, and I forgot they were doing that. Oh, good. <laughs> I mean, if nothing else... This has kind of confirmed my suspicion that just that Square Enix JRPGs are just not really for me. Like they're fun and enjoyable to play, but like they're just definitely not like things I I, I feel the need that I that I can really get into. With Aurelius key in hand, we may at long last land a grievous blow against Tizanta. Must speak with the other villagers and learn what they know of it. We can enter the homes too. Okay. What's mother trying to say? So no, we have to find that key. Find that key. We'll find it. I know we need to search the village, but what are we searching for? Great question. One of the weaker titles, FF14, is better. Fair enough. I know nothing of any key, and you'll find nothing of any import to my home. It took such great pains to flee the source, yet our past continues to haunt us. I'm so tainted after all. I don't think that's the case, but... Hey, GJ! But it's also an MMO, so... Yeah, I have no interest in playing MMOs. Not, not like, n nothing against them. It just, I, I, I don't... Got a history there, and I don't intend to repeat it, so... Something special in the village. If what you seek is old, the elder may know of it. I cling to the thought that Lady Orlea's last great hope for us lay in this very village. Which is to be true from the bottom of my heart. Tactics Ogre Tracker. Yeah, like, Tactics Ogre, I'm I I will re I'm going to replay because, like, I played it originally when I was a kid and I've got fond, like, nostalgia memories of it, so. Right, but... Yeah, Tactics Ogre. Legend so old it's been forgotten, or someone keeping something from us. We have no choice but to upend the village in our search. For something old? I seem to recall a rather old-looking mirror behind the Elder's house. It's quite brilliant all those years ago, but... I'm sure it's rusted over by now. A mirror, huh? Alright. Hey, Arador. I was of a long dark history being oppressed, and I reckon they're none too happy about outsiders us, like us reminding them of it. That's, yeah, actually very thoughtful of you. Mommy and Daddy are really upset. I'm scared. Anything special? There's a pelt and drums of bow that his parents were quite fond of. It's an old rusty mirror. Ah, yes, that's the one. Pray, wait a moment. I'll polish it for you. I always imagine a Shrek RPG. Ah, <laughs> nice. Not beautiful. Or the designs of this mirror are exquisite. No idea such the rust did such splendor. Why'd you leave this out in the weather? Perhaps this mirror is the key that'll show us the way forward. Sarah Noah, you can't replace. You can't replace your scales with a mirror.
Why did I get a, str a strength conviction strengthened for taking a ladder? I guess. Should seek out the one who knows the legend of the Roselle. It'll be your best chance at finding the key. Just want to live our lives. Why must we be chased? This, this is your fault. Because Sarah knows conviction is parkour. Yeah, you're right. You're right. You're right. Don't get. We gotta push the invading army out of my swamp. Going up a ladder strengthened your parkour convictions. Yes, it did. We. Are you looking for Sarah's treasure? An incredible hit in this village. You heard anything about it? Simply parkour away from Norzel and his beast. <laughs> to your parkour. <laughs> oh, man. My triangle strategy fanfiction is taking shape now. Do you think I've been powers that sell anyone sitting in a desk drawer? I call it my secret sweet store. I'm going to eat it when, all, when no one's looking. Is that so? Well, thank you for telling me. You have my word. I shan't tell another soul. Yes, yeah, Sarah Noah. Not snitching. How's that ladder animation, buddy? There was one ladder here we haven't used yet. Got it. Yeah! Ladder time. Hey, Gila. Number of objects within the village that can quantify is the key we're looking for. Anything special and unusual in the village? Not that I've ever heard of. So it's something about a pelt as well. Gives me for being noble, not for being a snitch. Exactly, exactly. I've seen a pelt this color before. Perhaps this is the one Jerome's parents took such a liking to. Perhaps this pelt is the key that'll show us the way forward. The pink pelt. The pink mirror. Hmm. Was it just me or was that interactable but didn't light up? Oh no. Sucks for us. One of your one of your rugs is kinda futzed about, friendo. All right, I think that's everything we got here. I didn't see anything else that we could interact with, so. I think we should be good. Pink mirror, an old mirror found in the Roselle village, covered in rust, but careful polishing revealed vivid pink patterning underneath. Pink for an animal hide that once adored Jerome's home. He kept it as a memento of his late parents. Huh. All right. Well, let us away. Yo, Doho Wario. True end, Cerno becomes a wandering parkour pro in Ohio. <laughs> Elder, for the sake of the Roselle, I've come to speak with you about the key. Lord Cernoa, I am not one to speak in metaphor and code. I bid you tell me precisely what it is you seek. There was one more we missed. Oh, shit. Well, fuck.
Oops. Yeah, I... I thought I was thorough, but apparently not thorough enough. And that I, I, bothers me. Whoops, I guess. Yeah. So which one are we picking? Think this is something that's stupid to find? Fun. Bad end? Apparently. Do you think this pink mirror could be the key? Being there during your playthrough? Play but for your you're doing your playthrough? You save scum this? Pink pattern suggests this mirror is quite old. Might it Evie typed it. Okay, I was, like, I, I was gonna be like, "You're welcome," but I don't recall. I never thought I'd see this again. It was a gift from my late wife. I scarcely recognized it without all the rust. Might this be the key? No, I can't say it is. But you'll never know how grateful I am that you found it. Fun. Where's our last autosave? So that wasn't the key. Might this pink pelt be the key? Ah, uh, the pelt of a pink boar. I suppose you haven't encountered them near the castle or the harbor. Hmm. But they are all around us here. Hmm. Ah. I am just an old man, Lord Sarnoff. I assure you, I know nothing of this. Well, let's see where the last autosave is. I've shown the elder. I suppose whatever. Oh, it just autosaved on us. Woo! All right, never mind. The sun. We've got nothing to show for it. Huh. Roland, I have a well, that's ask of you. unfortunate. And what might that be? Take Frederica and get out of here. Had to save from yesterday, right? Yeah. Saranoa. All right, time to replay everything. Please, live on. And what will you do? I shall stay. You s <sighs> I shall s Frederica. As will I. Well, I guess who's ready to speed through all the cutscenes we already watched, huh? Roland. Congrats on beating the game. Thanks, apparently. And I refuse to leave Frederica. You sure you were Benedict. Anna, you say no more. I am with you. Anna. Stop sulking, all of you. This ain't like House Wolfort at all. I suppose you're right. Can't we wait to wait to see the true key, the pink scales. Until the very end. Yeah, what do we think the real key is then? Will none of you go? <sighs> I see. Because without you have no real way to actually resist Hyzanta. Fair enough. Pink scales. We make our stand I refuse to re leave Frederica because I would pay no mind to how I voted the other day. She failed to find some random pink thing? Apparently. Today may be the day the Wolfort name vanishes from history, but we have nothing to fear, for our memory shall be engraved. I've forgotten pink plate for the scale that turns it into a four way scale. No! They will remember that Wolfort fought proudly in this land of Norzelia. Byzantian army strikes at dawn, sieging the Rosellan village where House Wolfort entrenches themselves. Despite the overwhelming difference in their military might, the battle rages. We figured we found the key. The key is apparently a weapon that lets us burn the Rosellan village down ourselves. That night, 
the Wolfort name. Wow! Map of Norzelia. Some say they were tragic heroes who remained true to their beliefs until the end. Others insist huh. they were merely visionless dreamers who touted justice. Huh? Well, shit. But soon, even the voices that speak of them vanish. All that remains is fire and blood. The war rages on. Oh, I love fire.png. Some post on one bad ending being slow. The end. Wow. All right, everyone. Thank you for coming. All right. What a what a what a great game. Uh, thanks for coming to the stream. And no. If you did not save, load the autosave data. Oh, it it kindly does that for us, huh? That's triangle strategy in the books. All right, who's ready to fast forward through some cutscenes? We. Rolling around at the speed of sound. Do you record our shortest palette of stream? I think we had one that was like half an hour long because my internet cut out. All right, let's pay more attention. Okay. We got to make sure I get my strength and conviction. The Elder may know of it. Okay. Or someone keeping something from us, huh? So, they seem to think someone is purposely keeping something from us. You want help? I got the answer. Let me take another look around before I give up for good. Or an order possibly multiple times, which the game hasn't needed you to do previously. Oh, fun! Okay. Well, uh, I guess we'll try that. I was trying to see the answer out right. Appreciate it. Oh, no. Sarah, no. All right. Well, that's fair. It tells about the, the sweets. I'm going to find that kid's sweets drawer. It was actually in the sweet store. I, I, you know what? There's a part of me that's thinking, like, what if it is in the sweet store? What if that is what we're looking for, actually, though? Is there a doorway to a home I have that I missed? All right. Let's also go grab the pelt.
Go talk to people multiple times. Woo! All right. Bad end of this obfuscated scavenger hunt is very funny in a why game. Why? why? Yeah, like, it'd be one thing if this was, like, how we were expected to deal with this kind of stuff for the beginning, but, like. Hmm. Oh, I see. Benedict wants to search here himself, huh? Okay. So we gotta get. Search his own self perfectly while he is away. No, he would not grant such a quest to the likes of me. Uh, what about Jerome? So I think we I think we have our way forward here, right? Benedict wants to search the elder's home on his own, but he needs to get the elder away. So we got to find someone to drag the elder away for him. It was a long shot and worth it despite that. Fair enough. Oh, there we go. We ask Frederica. Okay. So undercut explore completely and don't worry, there's some stupid bullshit you can't complain about and you can complain about in a moment anyways. Awesome. Lines with Lady Frederica. What do I want the honor? What would you ask of me? Choice leads to a bad ending, and the bad ending are three dungeons apart. Woo! Hell yeah. A box hidden beneath the rug? Seemed the elder did have something to hide. Perhaps the rock is the key that'll show us the way forward. The pink rock, huh? All right. Did we find the thing? Are we all good now? Well, I think we should be good now. Party members saying perhaps this wasn't a good decision. Woo! Game design! Elder, for the sake of the Roselle. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Start with the pelt. Pink mirror. Found a rock salt. Could this pink rock be the key? Where did you find that? So it is the key. What do you know of it? Clearly, I can deceive you no longer. I shall tell you. Wait, everything. why? If you knew this, why would you let the village get destroyed rather than saying anything? What the fuck, man? Amber to me, but maybe just because you saturated. It, it's, it's pink on my screen. But, like, I guess I could see it being an amber. You might be looking at it with the sepia filter on. A simple taste shall tell you all you need to know. Rock salt. Wait, you actually licked the rock? Lord, Lord Saranoa, please do not go around licking the rock. My word. It tastes of salt. No, it, it is salt. Truly. A rock of salt. Indeed, it is. And the story behind it is a long... Woo, we can make some lamps out of this shit. This crystal before you was brought here 
by Lady Aurea. My mother brought this? And you knew of this the whole time, Elder? Yes, but the seeds of conflict ought not to be left in the sun where they are apt to grow. That was our decision. So can't believe he made Benedict lick that. Sir Noah would have licked it himself. Are there any other crystals like this? There are. Lady Orlea spoke of a repository rife with salt hidden somewhere in Norselia. And where might that somewhere be? I wonder. I wonder where it might be, Sarah Noah. Unfortunately, I do not know. And I fear the knowledge passed with Lady Olea herself. <laughs> I do like to do a little trolling. Do you know anything about this, Lady Frederica? Anything at all? Did your mother ever mention these crystals to you before? It is imperative. I apologize, but this is my first time hearing of them as well. That's the extreme garbage. Wow, he'd rather let his village get bulldozed than say anything about it. Woo! Yourself, Benedict. Maybe his Alzheimer's? Uh, <laughs> Salt is hidden in the Triangle God's secret. Clearly, they need to find the Norzellan Triangle. Calm myself. The very existence of this crystal changes the nature of our realm as we know it. If you have ever wondered why Hazat oppresses the Roselle or confines them to the source, this is your answer. Maybe the real salt was the friends we made along. I'm getting pretty salty right now. Repository and monopolize salt, and not just that. Anyone who finds that repository could reign over all Norzelia. How did you pronounce that? Could oh, reign. No, no, you said okay. Nors Would it really have so great an influence? Sim ran some of Red Eridor's calm yourself as fuck yourself. I was very confused for a split second. I can see him saying that though. It is one of Hyzant's fundamental beliefs. One that, due to their Getting salty down here? A little bit, yes. Has appeared true all these years. But no longer. With this crystal alone, we can prove their doctrine false. Revealing their absolute teachings to be mere fabrications would shake Hyzen to its very core. There may be hope for us yet. A report, my lord. Hyzen's army is on the Woo, religion! Yeah. Lord Serenoa, if you would, I should like to be the one to speak to them. Of course, Benedict. I leave the matter in your capable hands. She treats salt as important as it is, was in history, but it's still silly. It is a little silly. It, like I, I get it that it's that it, that there's historical accuracy to it, but it's like still a little bit silly. Seems kind of dumb. I don't know. Lord Saranoa, how unfortunate it is for us to meet under such circumstances. Mm. Eh, I think we could take him. Disobeying the Holy One's order, I must strike you down. Before that, Minister Exham, there is something we wish to show you. Salt World, yeah, you showed me that. It is a mere fragment of something we have discovered in this village. It is a crystal made entirely of salt. What madness is this you speak? This is salt indeed. How is this possible? It appears to have been passed down among the Roselle and in a quantity large enough to rival the source. Unbelievable. Mm. so, but we have proof. It's weird to think about. Yeah. Salt can be found in places other than the sacred grounds beneath the goddess's feet. I am certain the implications did not escape you. What is it that you want? An audience with the Holy One, and a guarantee of safety for us and everyone in this village. To 
be a waste to dispose of both the crystal and house Got lucky they sent X arm. Yeah, X arm seems like the one that would have been like that that could possibly be like well, amenable to this I line of reasoning, right? Bulldozing the village anyway to keep this a secret. It's because it's X arm specifically, right? And you have my word, the village will be safe from harm. Because X arm in particular Everybody would be concerned about yeah, yeah, I can see that. Oh, how I wish I could see the Holy One's face contorted so. <sighs> Five of the other seven would just have bulldozed it. Yeah. We owe our lives to this. A crystal of salt. Or... Salt they didn't send one of those zealots whose first response to something like that shakes their faith is, I choose not to believe, so now I shall kill you. Yeah. Luckily, their military man has other ambitions and ideas. Rad. The Holy State's teachings are false. The goddess's blessings spread across all Norsalia. So, th if we hadn't already confirmed it, this can pretty much confirms that what they find in the mine is salt, right? Remember the last time he transported salt? He's doing it again. God damn it, dude. Stop being so salty. The blessing that shall be the key to the chains that bind our people. Can you imagine if crystals like this were hidden beneath the surface of Norzelia? I cannot imagine Hyzant being blind to their existence. Salt is the lifeblood of their nation. Agreed. Which leads me to believe that they have relentlessly oppressed the road. So Sir Noah doesn't leave it unguarded again? Yeah, that would be bad. You intend to negotiate with the Holy One then? Correct. This time we shan't fail. Not with this salt crystal in our hands. Hyzant <sighs> will swear its support to us. If their teachings are truly false. Could you not ask them to free the Rizal at the source? That is a risk we cannot afford to take. <laughs> uh-huh. Our first priority is rebuilding Wolfort. Without it, we cannot even hope to protect our own Rizal. I mean, village. yeah, you're right. Do it's just... You it, it's... <laughs> I yeah. I suppose you are right. And what will you do once granted those privileges, Benedict? What will I do? I tire of being made to decide like this time and time again. Don't you, Saranoa? I do. Our choices grow ever harder, each time piercing me deeper. It's time we decide what to do for ourselves. I wish to reclaim Glenbrook. With Hyzant beside us, we can defeat... Time for the scale. <laughs> You're right. It's time for me to decide what to do for myself. Grab the scale. Nope. 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 Only rivers? Oh, uh, we haven't seen any oceans. We've only seen rivers. <sighs> House Wolford protects the Roselle in defiance of the Holy One's orders. Hyzant sends an army to punish Wolford for their disobedience. Cornered though they may be, Serenoa and his comrades discover a crystal of salt hidden in the Rosellan village. Benedict leverages its very existence in negotiations with the opposing General Exum. And we haven't heard much of Esfrost in a while, right? Yeah. Don't we still have an inroad with one of their generals up there? The crystal holds the power to change not only Hyzant. The entire land of Norzelia. With it in hand, Sarah Noah goes to meet the Holy One. Oceans would mean salty water, and that by itself would defy the religion, unless the zealot someone dried up the ocean or covered up in the distant past. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, yeah, because this is Norzelia, right? Uh, the, all the rivers seem to flow down this direction. So presumably off the south of the map there's an ocean, but like...
Checking the Roselle is part of the golden ending, and also along with meeting and trusting Svarog. Oh! Well, we can't get golden ending because I'm pretty sure I burned our village down. But, you know, we're doing all right. We granted you an audience because of Minister Axam's petition, but I did not expect you to show us this. D you didn't bring the whole thing, did you? Don't bring the whole thing! Gustav just chilling in the castle with his very con consenting bride, starting at the wall, staring at the wall for six hours. Yeah, we kind of forgot about that. A crystal made of salt. How very fascinating. It certainly does contradict the doctrine here in our blessed land. Or it would, were it real. Have you any proof that this was not created by magic or technology? Well... With all due respect, Minister, I have a question for you in return. What do you think of Esfrost and Glenbrook's decree to stop trade with Hyzant? I think it's nothing more than a threat. Neither would last very long without our... Yeah, support. but what if... Gustadov is no fool. Such an edict would not come without proper countermeasures in place. Countermeasures such as another source of salt, for example. Having their own salt would make Hyzant's redundant at best, and your nation would soon find itself in dire straits without the salt taxes revenue. What is it you want from us? Mm. Your full support. Lend us your strength, and together we can defeat Esfrost, and Hyzant's ties to all nations will remain intact. You mean to start a war. The Kingdom of Glenbrook may be not but a puppet now, but it was once your homeland. You understand this, yes? Salt was created, would it still break the monopoly? Scalability? Uh, yeah, 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 scalability, definitely. We do. Even so, my people do not wish for war. We must try to resolve this peacefully first. Do you think Gustadolf can be reasoned with? Need I remind you that it was he who invaded Glenbrook? He is a wolf in sheep's clothing. Be that as it mm. may. Neither my people nor soldiers will accept it as a reason to go to war. Then I shall give you one. For I am the second son of King Regna. Roland Glenbrook. Yo! You live. There is no mistaking that face. Huh. So the prince lives to slay his kingdom's invader. We could not ask for a better reason. If you need a just cause to go to war, let it be me. We must stop Gustadolf. Okay. <laughs> it all makes sense now. Oh, Holy One, have you heard? Pray tell me. Break the monopoly, but not the religion. If anything, if the salt was artificial, they could claim sacrilege and fan the flames even further. Yeah, that that's true. Prince Roland, heed the words of the Holy One. The holy state of Hyzant stands with you. The Holy One would see you defeat Esfrost and restore peace to Norzeria. Our nation shall spare no effort in your fight against Gustav. Well, that worked out. From this day forth, we support Prince Roland as our commander and Lord Serenoa as one of the saintly seven. Me? A saint? We are brethren now. We ride to Well war. then. All right. Okay. Radical. Well, would you look at that? We secured high sand support. I'm sure nothing will go wrong. Yeah, I don't know how I feel about being named one of the saintly seven to a different country, but you know what? Whatever, sure. Better, better than dying. Better than dying. Enjoy Saint Tim in the slavery country. I. I hope. I hope. I. Ho I just hope Hyzanta knows that we're gonna circle back to that. Like we got like immediate problems, and then we got we got to circle back to the whole slavery thing, right? Like I feel like that's important. I feel like you don't. We can't just let that slide. 
Until the war ends and the race system comes back. Right? <laughs> Good going, lad. Oh, it is Benedict and Roland to whom we owe this victory. Everyone here has suffered so much on my behalf. My weakness and worthlessness have brought pain and misfortune to you all. And for that, I... Edor is very trustworthy and won't backstab us the, moment, the worst possible moment to keep the second salt sword secret. Yeah! Yeah! Not killing you. We need some other guarantee that you won't tell us everyone a religious faith. You've got nothing to apologize for. I already told you. House Wolfort's the sword and shield of the crown. I've decided that I must press forward. Even if it means crawling forth on my hands and knees. I ask for your support as always. I know I will need it. And you shall have it. I am with you every step of the way, my lord. Rad. Is something the matter, Federica? No. My apologies for worrying you. Now, to battle. We take back Glenbrook with our own hands. Woo! Let's hear it for the scrappy group of uh, adventurers. And their army from Hyzanta. Did you know about this salt crystal exam? No, neither did I know of Prince Roland's survival. I thought he had perished. Sure, sir, no, we'll use this newfound saint to change the system from the inside. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm sure. I'm sure he'll try to change it. He, see, you see, it's just a bunch of bad apples. That's what it is. Well, the, what we really... We don't need to dismantle the system. What we need is more good people working within it. Right? Right? Is a grand nation, but Achievement unlocked. Try to like stop racism, but become the saint of racism villain instead. <laughs> Shit. We tried to defeat the CEO of racism, but in the process, we became the CEO of racism ourselves. SK started streaming 69 minutes ago. Nice! Let's go GS over again. <laughs> oh, man. Kind of is. Were we not able to trade, there is no doubt our nation would wither to naught. We have relied solely on salt for <laughs> Zizaku. It was made painfully clear to us. <laughs> is it bad that when you say Code Geass, the first thing that pops into my mind isn't even Code Geass, but fucking, uh, soup? Hey, I need help. Can you come over here? I can't. I'm buying clothes. I can't. How do you do this? I can't. I can't. I'm buying clothes. Eh, something close to that. Soup joke is a classic. It's good. <laughs> it's good shit. Harsh words. But true nonetheless. Saintly Seven went from 100% racist to 85% racist. Victory. If that, if that isn't incrementalism, then I don't know what is. My words. Went through Kogates for the first time a couple months ago. No oh, I hope you enjoyed it. It's it's good. I I I I legitimately enjoy Code Geass. Suzaku sure was a cop. Yeah, like it's not perfect, but I found it better than average, and I enjoyed it. I also do have just a noted appreciation for very, you know, very tropey kind of uh, shown and stuff like that. So, you know, could just be my taste, but I enjoyed it. Frederica to become a saint and all issues will be solved instantly. I think I think what might what might make make it a bit clearer why that's my favorite is like one of my favorite novels ever is fucking The Count of Monte Cristo. I do have an appreciation for that that kind of character archetype. So it, I that that definitely plays into it some. CC was pronounced C two and not CC. Yeah, yeah, like I get it, but it should have been CC. It's really dumb, but it's a fun ride. Yeah, exactly. 
you go in knowing it's dumb, it's fun. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's fair. To deliver our Elfrith to House Wolfort. Sarah, no, I'm not racist. My arranged marriage fiancé is a minority. Oh, shit, not Elfric. And here I thought your research results to be top secret. What a curious turn of events. The uh, movie of Gias in the theater of two of other people, so it's almost by itself. Nice. They could easily sink in as frosty ship or two. And yet I see not a trace of a smile on you. I never wanted to build weapons for war. Uh-oh. <laughs> yet you don't think twice about toying with human lives. <laughs> and yet, you live in a society yourself. Curious. How dare you. Who is this bewitching dancer that keeps showing up? Is she an actual character? She doesn't have a profile, but we keep she keeps showing up in different places doing instigating shit. She does like to instigate. The audacity of Edor's dog. I had to become the secret final antagonist. Nice. A lot of people who did atrocities got off pretty scot-free. Yeah. Yeah. That is valid. Are you certain it's wise to return to I mean, Frost the thing is, like, I, I, I always find stories yeah, like I'm that, sure. uh, like, I, I at least find stories like that interesting to me because I... I like characters that take big swings to try to change the world, whether or not you know they're good or bad, and then have to deal with the consequences of having a vision that they want to bring about. And it's it, it, it's it, it, I I like characters like uh, I like characters that are uh, I've watched Black Arrow. I have not yet. Treats anything after the early bits. Yeah, that's fair. And before Bewitching Dancer will join Gustav and give him double turns. Shit! I'm afraid matters are far too great. I I don't think do, would combat dancers work in a game like this, like in a game where the turn order isn't like our turn then their turn. Away with it is fine. I'm with, uh, if I'm getting away with it, it's for something. Yeah, yeah. Svarog's deception is nearing its climax. His ill-gotten profits. Svarg's building a weapon, huh? Weapon of untold destructive power. Our anonymous source from the manufactory hinted at as much. Svarog's what the fuck is Svarog up to? Death smell. What's that? Let the Could give Anna's you. double action for a turn or something? Maybe. to be wed then there should be trust between us how long do you intend on treating me like a child very well tell her Thalos. if you insist brother hmm. this weapon combines the powerful explosives developed by dragan with esfros master a couple ways to make a character powers. act right after another character in this game then they are completely broken yeah. Back arrows the by the director code Gias and the writer of Kill a Kill, Gurren Lagan, Promare. Really good stars. Pimbo and Refined Princess and Euphemia. <laughs> nice. That does sound cool, actually. Although yet to be tested, this cannon is said to have the power to breach even Hyzant's walls. The goddess's shield would buckle under a single blast. But the shield is impregnable. Oh. So they developed a cannon. I have heard nothing of this. Do you think so little of your general? A general is to win me victory, as and when I command it. <sighs> Svarog's intent isn't to bring Hyzant to heel, however. He means to use the cannon against brother. Mm. But the fool was so blinded by ambition that he never saw the strings guiding his every deed. See that? Okay, that's a good Erica voice. 
I, I could raise you one more, though. He served his purpose well. The cannon could not have been made without his engineers and Dragan's research. He will die secure in the knowledge that his bloodline contributed to the glory of Esfros. Sadly, we'll get it at some point, hopefully. Yes. Yeah, yeah. With it, we shall do what I mean, I mean, let's be fair. Code Geass isn't like fucking transcendent or anything but it, it's it's fun it's enjoyable and it's it's worth the it's worth the time if we can even approach the walls brother the trade embargo will ensure that Pizant is especially wary of our actions Dallas an entire essay about this brand new weapon no one's ever heard of it before Erica so this cannon <laughs> <laughs> on the contrary their focus will turn inward with not else to leverage their influence with they will take measures to see that none of their precious salt escapes <sighs> their borders. There may be some national Legend of the Galactic Heroes? Sure. Yeah, when there I have, like, to hide I don't know, to most of a year to watch anime, I'll do that. Erica, muster a force and march to the Hierophant's palace at once. Deliver to Heisen the final demands. As you wish, brother. I shall gather what news I can of the Satan Seven's machinations. Thought the pizza thing was just a mean, then C2 was a pizza gobbler. <laughs> I do love that about C2. I do appreciate that she's a little pizza goblin. <laughs> Thalus, <laughs> Name a more iconic duo than C2 and pizza. You wound me so, but it's true. <laughs> that's one, It's one of those things that's unfortunate, because it's just like, it, yeah, I'm sure it's a good time, because people speak highly of it, but like, I don't know if I have the energy to, like, it, it takes a kind of amount of conviction to say, I'm going to start an anime series this long. It's also one of the reasons I haven't really gotten into, um, uh, fucking, what is it? You the comedy ask, one brother. that's so fucking long. And also another reason I haven't, like, gotten into Space Brothers yet, despite really wanting to. It's, like, a hundred episodes long. I don't know if I, like, I can barely make it through a 13-episode anime. With with my current level of focus, right? I I, I don't want to commit to a ninety like a hundred plus episodes. Even as on flesh and blood are the tools to be used and then discarded when their purpose is served. He has faith only in himself. Send so your brother's soon to be child bride to let the adults talk. It just has horrible vibes all around. Yeah. Well, hey, we did it. Woo! We watch a Torador because it's a tradition for me to watch it around Christmas for some reason. Oh, hey, there you go. Esfrost and Glenbrook remain strong after. Subject of anime: Watch Princess Principal, lesbian steampunk spies. What? 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 But you uh, several of those words called out to me. What? Gustadol sends Erica to Hyzant to deliver his ultimatum, and dispatches an army to Glenbrook to increase the pressure on the. Holy I've not heard of this one. Okay, here's here's the question though: Is it lesb? Is it is it actually lesbian, or is it just like gay bait? Actually, you know what? You know what? Here you go. Here you go. March comes in like a lion. Isn't it the uh, one where they play? Is it Shogi? I've heard good things about that one. If you want to recommend me an anime, this is the time to do so. However, I am only accepting recommendations for anime with lesbians in it. That is what I want to watch right now. And I'm running so low on that. Bochi the Rock has become one of my favorites. I like Bochi! That's such a great show. I've been enjoying that so far. I really enjoy the animation in it. My uh I changed I changed my uh profile picture recently to one of uh one of Bochi faces. Because she is she is very good. <laughs> Softly but surely. Norzelia descends into war once more.
What's the next Bochi episode anyway? Saturday? It's a Saturday show, right? Yeah. Torador PSP yeah, game is in English much translate much if you want to go that route. Okay. Layback camp? All right, all right. Come to think of it, I heard that Wolfort was added to your saintly ranks. The new Higarashi levels, okay? I would like to watch that. However, obviously I can't watch the Higarashi anime just yet. Bochi only managed to follow G-Witch this season. Yeah! G-Witch has been very good. I've been having a hard time, like... I, I'm enjoying G-Witch. I've had a hard time kind of, like, wrapping my head around all the intricacies of it. Because it, it, it's... I don't I don't know. The, 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 the intricacies of the setting are kind of... And the subtleties of, like, like the political parts of it are kind of moving past me. But I'm enjoying my time with it. Bochi is very good. Which, from Mercury, has been satisfying my lesbian needs. Yeah, it is. Although, you know, as of the most recent episode. Oh, no. <laughs> Where might but I'm glad to know that people are recommending Bochi and, and uh, G-Witch. Because uh, they're very good shows. I'm afraid I cannot answer that. The dealings of the Saintly Seven are our business and ours alone. How disappointing. I had hoped to congratulate him on his promotion. Get out of here, Erica. That wretched woman. Those are hardly wishes. Can't have the game without the pain. Exactly. Estrost all but demands us open the source to restore our diplomatic relations. The duchy fears neither a lack of salt nor the goddess's shield. You can assume they have a plan in mind. Hmm. Then this was no more than a ploy to stall the time. Do I have any ear to recommend other than the classic ones everyone's already heard about? Fair enough. We had best I guess, I guess the, the, yeah. It is what it is. Oh, you know what? Here you go, here you go, here you go. Anyone have a good Yuri light novel series to recommend? Saleta's just great. Saleta is so good. Although, Saleta. Forgetta. Ah! <laughs> I really enjoy... So here's the thing. I think I've been spoiled by reading um, Other Side Picnic. Because now I can't... Like, I, like, I go back and I watch... I can't watch Yuri of just, like, high school girls learning how to be lesbians. It's just not interesting anymore. And I don't like it. I want to read about fucking adults doing... That. It's... Ah! Princess Principle is good. All the characters are the only unique European accent. Japanese characters keep the original dubbing. That's really cool! Minister Exam, send word to Minister Serenora. And read about adults. That's that's what I want. There, there are manga for you. There are. I think the problem is I started, I started coming from anime. So, like... And th those aren't the ones that get anime adaptations first. And so it's been a, it's been a process, but we're getting there. You wish to lend us high Zant's new Yeah, it's because like I look for Yuri and everything's like, oh, you should you should watch like 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 Sweet Blue Flowers, and I'm like, no, I don't. I guess. Eh. Weapon is one Minister Lila develops in secret. So what's the weapon? The fuck is this? I compressed a vast quantity of magic into crystal form. We call this weapon Elfrey. What? The fuck are we supposed to do with this? The glass crystals have yet to be perfected, but they can decimate a castle wall easily enough. Oh, they're explosives. Okay. That feeling would work is so good. It raises the bar so high it ruins everything else. Yeah. Yeah. Just so we can evolve a handful of Pokemon now. Yeah, there we go. Murder magic crystals. Yeah. Be forewarned that their power makes them unwieldy in an average battle. They are not meant to be used on people. Furthermore... We are only giving you a single blast crystal. Regardless, 
I am certain it will come in handy while recapturing Whiteholm Castle. Its incomplete nature makes it regrettably tricky to use. But Milo should be able to take care of that for you. Use them both wisely. I am Milo. Oh, hey, Milo. A dancer by trade, but assistant to the saintly Seven on occasion. I shall serve you, Minister Saranoa, until we reclaim... Oh, is she the bewitching dancer? Okay. Milo Uel, a dancer appears almost out of thin air to do the saintly seven's bidding. Serves that their spine can easily hold her own in fight. Awesome! The bewitching dancer. You sure you'll be okay? You needn't worry. It isn't my first time flirting with Jane. Awesome. So is she an actual dancer unit then? Does she like do extra turns? Glad to see where uh, Benedict's thought is at, though. Can we entrust command to you, Mr. Sarah? Most certainly. And the crystal will be key in our plan to reclaim Glenbrook. Hmm, Heart of the Woods is a good Yuri event. I do love Heart of the Woods! I, I've read Heart of the Woods. I played the Switch port of it, though, which is very unoptimized, which is unfortunate, but... Yeah, I do love me some Studio Elan stuff. Adult gay animated side that is, like, a uh, very questionable. Normal gay is hardly good enough, and most of the time it's just bait. Yeah, that's fair. DIY has girls that are pretty gay. You have made a great ah. error in allowing thieves to raid the archives, Constable Sickness. Forgive me. My guards gave chase as soon as they noticed intruders, but they'd already fled beyond our reach. Basically, it comes from manga. Yeah. Yeah. Also probably censored. Yeah, the switchboard doesn't have the uh, any of the uh, extra stuff in it. What did they take? Luckily, they were unable to gain entry to where we... Which is, like, fine. I don't need, like, attack. that stuff to enjoy a thing. You know, it... All they were able to make what it is was a single book penned by the late Lady Orlea. Orlea? She left behind a message of sorts? She'd better be passed on to Lady Frederica when she came of age, but it seems those wishes were forgotten. Hmm. Thalos or Erica must have hidden it from her. They derived <laughs> no greater pleasure than from talking her. What dicks? Do we know what was written in this book? No. Storage records indicate it was protected by some arcane seal. We're going to read more adult gay at some point. We're behind on the high school gay in my reading list. Yeah. It's just, uh, like, as I get, like, I get that it's the that's the most common genre and, then, and like, you know, C, G, D, C, T, right? It sells. <laughs> um, but, like, as I get older, like, I, I don't really like reading about that. It's not the kind of romance I want to read anymore. It just feels weird. So I have mirror tights. That satisfies it. You're right. I have got mirror tights. What more could I want? What more could I want? Perhaps something to do with the Rosellan liberation, for which she fought so fiercely. Or perhaps it is not but a mother complaining to her daughter of a duchy they both despise. We'll send a party to hunt down the thieves at once. No need. Such ruffians are unlikely to be in the employ of our foe. No doubt they were even a basic uh, stuff with college woman like how we do re relationship. Yeah, like, like that's great. Some of that, please. Just relationship as a starting point. Yeah. The and that's why, uh, and that's Just like why I really think. Fucking other side picnic has has kind of ruined me for <laughs> for other Yuri now because it's like now I expect to have really compelling, <laughs> really compelling genre fiction alongside it. I guess I haven't made much progress lately. Ah shucks. Uh, which one of these do we do? Oh, let's see what uh, Huet is doing over here. 
Because the last shared experience people can relate to makes it have more market appeal, thus sell more. Yeah, like, like, I, like, I totally get that. Like, I, 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 I completely understand that there's more to it than than just like than just that. Like, it is something that everyone all, all go it gets. It's the last. Yeah, like that makes sense to me. I'm not arguing against that. It just. <sighs> Despite how much I can relate to it on that level, it's it, like when it comes to specifically like romance stuff, I don't want to read about that. Like, like it, it just it it feels weird. It, which is why, like, I still I still love watching shows about teenage teenagers in high school, right? Like, uh, but fucking Bochy the Rock this season has been phenomenal. I love that show, but I love it for the other reasons. Oh, wait, how do we... Relationship was the name of a thing? Oh. Okay. I didn't realize that was actually the name of a thing. Why did he ask me to come here in the first place? Tool for high school romance to be compelling and morbid. Yeah! Like, it's... It, it, and, like, it, to be honest, like, it just feels like... It, it feels weirder as I get older because it's like, I don't want to be reading about... Like, I'm, f I'm 30 at this point, right? Why am I reading about teenagers smooching? That, that feels weird, right? No correlation whatsoever. It's not even that they're stupid. That's like that's literally not the point. <laughs> like I, 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 it's not. The, the, the whatever. It's unimportant. Ah, tidings from Erica. She says hi, Zant refused our final offer you seem surprised there was no way Hyzant would agree to open the source I know that but the negotiations were meant to buy us time yet it seems their soldiers are already on the move damn it all this wasn't supposed to happen hmm if you play with fire you get burned now we have no recourse but to meet them in battle without the Archduke so it has come to war then War. We just have huh. to beat them at their own game. S. Frost wants his answer to make the salt open source. Vanguard. Yeah, there you go. You must be delighted that a former retainer to the crown is coming to visit. Right, Cordelia? Enough, Thallus. I won't allow such impudence. War. War never changes. Elevator game with the cat girls came out yesterday. Yuri Horror, get back to you if it's good. Oh, interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep me updated on this. Queen. This child Absolutely. Is Thank you. Puppet. Thank you, Reyna. And I believe the impotent one here is you, Aurora. A general has no right telling the prime minister what to do. I had no idea the prime minister's job was to torment the weak. Enough, General of War. I will answer the prime minister. As the queen of Glenbrook, I shall protect my kingdom until my dying breath, no matter who may stand against me. It appears your impudence is contagious, Aurora. Hmm. Your charge knows not how powerless she is. Worry not, your majesty. I shall protect you. Oh, these two have good energy. Killed her brother that one time, but you know, water under the bridge. Because I am to wed the Archduke? Because you are a warrior. One who does not give up, even if she must fight her battles alone. No idea what imagine an elevator game with cat girls, but I understand that I one of those words that I'm intrigued. <laughs> I've never heard of it before now, but no wonder these two are the second most popular pairing. Yeah, yeah. So I know better than anyone the pain of having to do everything on your own. Allow me to bear my heart to you as well, General of Laura. <laughs> as the last heir to the throne of Glenbrook, I do not intend to let Kristidol have his way. Imagine the eldest heir seen in Ava, but there are cat girls. <laughs> Categorically better. You mean to strike down the Archduke? 
but I lack the power to do so. Have you heard of the Warlets? They're aristocrats who are aid to my father. Speaking of Ava, certainly do love my Evangelion shoutouts and Bochi the Rock, am I right? That man Patriot was cozying up to the Archduke not seconds after King Bregna's beheading. Their kind knows no loyalty. Couple of cat girls test out an urban legend of a haunted elevator, and it's super haunted. Has not given any of them a position in awesome! The world, so they have fallen on hard times. No notes. Speaking of Ava, Ariel, huh? Yeah, yeah. Kind of uh, wondering what's going on there. Certainly has some uh, Ava qualities to it. No doubt they would wholeheartedly embrace you as their symbol, but only for their own purposes. Which elevator action returns on the Switch and <laughs> other systems now if you want a really good game. Wow, elevator action. Triangle strategy shippers. Gustadolf Cordelia. Horrible. Ranzen vibes. She's a child man. Avlora Cordelia. Sweet. Gay. Age. What is it? <laughs> Wait, how old is fucking Avlora? All right, because Cordelia is still a fucking child. What are we doing here? I understand that, but there certainly isn't a discrepancy in Arian Saleta's age. No, no, children of Mercury isn't distressing. Yeah, yeah. Wait, there. Well, yeah. I must have their support if I'm to reclaim Glenbrook. I don't know. I just assumed that Saleta was... I had always assumed Saleta was just uh, Ari under a different name for some reason that wasn't clear yet. And then it occurred... Like, it wasn't until after I started reading some of the fan stuff around it that I, that I considered the other angle to it. Because I'm a little slow on the cupcake. Is it possible for you to rein them in? Not alone. But with you, General of Lore, I can. They lack military might. If you accompany me, I could sway them to my cause. Please, General, lend me your strength. Vaguely distressing about G-Witch, just in the background once you notice the weird details not adding up. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's... Really, like, mm. and that's the thing. I wasn't expecting it at first, so like my first my my first watch to the show has been like pretty like surface level, and it wasn't until I start reading some of the other stuff people were talking about that I'm like, uh, oh oh that's happening in the background. Oh, did you not think I would tell the arch for the ERI in the actual show? I hadn't even noticed that. Shit. Well, that explains that. <laughs> of course I did. But SK doesn't know how to watch anime confirmed. As a mere decoration. So if it meant earning your trust, I was willing to show you that I wish to protect Glenbrook by any means necessary. You took a gamble. About uh Tomino's hatred of Elon and Richfield trying to escape climate change. Yeah. I have to. But it's not status or reward that moves me. <laughs> so you bet on my honor, and refusal would sully my name forever. However, safeguarding the kingdom comes first. Fighting at your side will have to wait. No sure not knowing it's going to be deep, and you need to pay attention. So you need to go back and watch the earlier episodes. That's fine. Oh, well, it'll be it'll be fun. Like I, I, I enjoy it enough that I don't mind going back to rewatch it. But yeah, it, it, I am gonna have to do a rewatch before I solidify my opinions. Even so, I will not falter. I must do this for my father and brothers. An admirable resolve. Slutter's reaction to that one conversation is immensely distressing. Mm. I shall be your sword and shield, my queen. Farewell. 
Thank you, General Cora. Wow. Anyway, this is happening. Triangle strategy is also happening here today. Cool, good for them. Party decides how to use the new weapon gifted them by Hyzanta. Alright. <sighs> Back from lunch, did you find the pink whatever? We did! We found the I pink whatever. But are you suggesting we destroy the dam around Telior Reservoir to start a flood? The capital city was built on the banks of the Norzelia River. Hmm, not a bad idea. Breaking the dam surrounding Lake Telly It was salt, because of course it was. I should have guessed that. You know what? I should have guessed that it was salt because it was pink and it wasn't one of those other things. That, that sh I should have been able to guess that. Flooding the town will throw their army into disarray. Which should allow us to take the place by storm. <laughs> really is better when the gals are more than pals. True! True. Lake Telior is a man made reservoir. You might be able to burst through with a blast crystal. Huet scouted the area earlier and reported seeing very few sentries. Proof enough that this is outside the Archduke's. Can the gals find the pink? Sass. Sass, what are you doing? Sass. Sass, stop this. <laughs> Gundam is all about political drama? It is! Is that effing salt? No, it can't be. Like a cloud. <laughs> but, you know, you gotta have gals be more than pals. Exactly! It makes everything better. <laughs> no. The damage will be too great. <laughs> no, we're not making this. <laughs> we're not making this into a phrase, Reyna. Stop this. We're not making this into... It's great when the God damn it. It's great when the gals find the pink, but you can't stream that on YouTube. <laughs> what have you all done to me? The means would not justify the end, Benedict. We cannot afford to lose. I agree with Roland. There is already far too much blood on our hands. Perhaps it's worth speaking with the people and gaining their understanding. Unless we reclaim Glenbrook, it's unlikely they'll understand or support our actions. Sending into decadence as mandatory at this point. I mean, yeah. We're <laughs> like so spelunking. For, okay. So that means you stand by Benedict then. <laughs> Fun. Fun, everyone. <laughs> Tell your reservoir you all you all bring out the worst the in me I hope you know that to protect the people from floods I doubt they would ever forgive us should we choose to destroy it for war Glenbrook thrives because of that water and to use it otherwise is inexcusable brute strength isn't the only way to reclaim the city we can strike at night and defeat the command. Nozillion mine tunnels sure are tight. Yeah. <laughs> I forgot. We're still talking about this, huh? We're still talk. We're still doing this. Saucy because this game is so horribly dry. <laughs> yeah, this game is so dry that the only thing way you're going to get. Uh, like the best color you can give me. <laughs> Shit. Oh, I love Aw, thanks, GJ. Heart. I'm making a heart with my. With my thumb and four fingers or pointer fingers but you can't see it so just know it's there if you try like a pink before, salt mine is a chance oh. it has been sealed off since there is more than one route we needn't worry so you mean not to use the blast crystal no i do after we sneak in we can sink s frost's warship hmm it would close off their escape route. I'm guessing that to get the golden ending, we have to not destroy the critical infrastructure. You adore, you adore dry political drama? And that's valid. It is totally okay to adore dry political drama. Chad doesn't give you constant psychic damage. I mean... Our first priority 
I guess. I don't know. I like to think that we've cultivated a different, like a, a, uh, a chat with a different kind of psychic damage that they choose to give me. We cannot allow them to be taken hostage. It would restrict our options as well. She's got a point. How would we I think it's that? the thing where, like, I can enjoy dry political drama, but the dry political drama alongside really dry and stilted writing is just especially in a medium where like you don't even have character portraits to tell you how like to show you visually how the characters are doing and also the voice acting is wooden because it was you know for understandable reasons but it's still very wooden it's just you really have to buy a, into a whole lot in order to enjoy what this game has and once you've done that it's fine like it's enjoyable i guess it's good but it's not like anything world like earth shattering and <laughs> so i don't know it, it it's we could use the blast crystal to destroy the bridge connecting the it is what it is like, I get that there's a vibe they're going for and that have everyone speak this way is part of in, it keeping that vibe, right? But if we encircle the castle, it certainly makes it harder to really engage with it. We could ask them to yield, free Glenbrook, and reestablish the trade between our nations. I am certain we can find a way to make both parties. Voices recorded remotely. Director could have instructed the voice actor to do a better job. I mean... Negotiate. Yeah. I understand your thoughts and the wishes held therein. Rich Pass Guest 3 was also dubbed remotely by HVA in their own house. The dub is very good. Yeah. Allow me to ask once more. Shall we shatter the dam around Lake Telior and flood the town? Sneak in under the guise of night, sink their ships, and slay their commanding officers? Do you remember how to kill gameplay the voices laid over? Yeah. Or destroy the bridge, safeguard the people, and negotiate with the enemy. Force the English VAs to act very... Is that really a the thing? Scales. It is time we decide our path. So make sure it's not good to the area. Oh! Okay. So it's just like a difference in like what sounds good to what sounds good to different ears. Okay. I mean, and that that makes sense to me at least. Like because like different culture, different way of speaking would have a different so different things sound natural to their ear. That that okay, sure. Fetch the scales. Wait, why is Milo getting to vote on this? You we haven't even used you in battle. What the fuck are you doing here, huh? Uh, <laughs> the fabled triple scale. All right. Destroy. So I think destroy the dam is right out. Because destroy the dam and would involve a lot of civilian casualties. And if there's one thing we've learned about this game is that the golden end wants you to avoid... Avoid making compromises on destroying the thing you're supposed to be protecting in order to protect it, right? Sir, no. Bring the scales, Milo. What the fuck is this shit? Yeah. Let's go to the city streets. PS1 era dubbing is done in Japan with Japanese VA director, which is why you would have stuff like RU1 and such. Yeah, fair enough. Blow up the ship because of the options were are war crimes probably or unrealistic? <laughs> yeah, it feels like destroying the dam is a war crime, right? Destroy the bridge, trap the enemy in the castle, then negotiate. Man with the racist, but doesn't want to murder non-minorities. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Frick is still in development and only a few people are privy to its details. For the rumors, the blast could blow a hole straight through the castle wall. 
Build development? They're hoping to use battle to test its powers. Chance we're exposing the people to greater damage than we thought. Let's consider the placement very carefully. Lord Saranoa, we've returned from scouting the capital. Crown City is teeming with us frosty soldiers. We have a second force led by General Ive Lords defending Whitehold Castle. As frosty soldiers stationed throughout the city and around the castle, the latter led by General Ive Lord, no less. Doubt a full frontal attack would work to our favor. Definitely worth considering when making our strategy. Hi, Milo. Lord Saranoa, I shall accompany you wherever you go. I'm sure my knowledge of Elfric will be a great service to you. All right. Compromising on all three ideologies at different at times, so you cannot navigate all the situation through some sort of consistent framework. Cool. Lord Saranoa, you've been out and about quite often lately. Is something amiss? Can't help but notice the comings and goings of Hyzanta soldiers, too. Something about it bodes ill. Yeah, well, something about your face bodes ill. Got him. All right, we already talked to you. Sorry about your home. How's your father doing? People are worried. We haven't heard of tidings of his health for some time now. Oh, that's right. We haven't... We haven't really even talked about Simone in a while, have we? Hmm. Hmm. Kind of just stops existing for a good bit. Yeah. Previous Archduke and Saints of old revered your father with good reason. King Late King Ringna trusted Lord Simon deeply and trusted him as one would a close friend. Were the two of them frequenting the tavern in their youth, drinking ale till the morning sun. No idea. One of the saintly seven now, Lord Saranoa. I dare say your accomplishments rival those of your father's. Do you look forward to seeing what lies ahead of you? I'm sure Lord Simon would say the same. Thank you. I my father or I could ask for better people. Sorry about destroying your homes that one time. My uncle's child is a soldier, but he's always busy these days. I haven't been able to talk to him at all. What you got for me, buddy? Hey, Dad, I became a saint of slavery. Yeah, right. <laughs> God damn, Sarah, what have you been up to? He's on death's door all the time. He's just on death's door. He's not dead yet, but he's, like, getting there. He'll get there eventually, I'm sure. The fall of houses fall Contelior. Many other people fled here to Wolfort. Refugees from the Crown City have also come to live within our domain. It's not uncommon to hear of fights breaking out between them and the people of Wolfort. What should we do, my lord? People have, very well, my lord, but I should warn you that our domain's resources will soon run dry. People's discontent continues to grow. You understand, but before either of those reach their limit, I shall bring Esfrost to its knees. Understood, my lord. Leave the issue of refugees to us. Just came back from the Crown City. She said there are more frosty soldiers there than ever now. Hmm. What else we got? Man, there's nothing in these homes for your lord to steal. 
Come on, we all know your Lord has butterfingers. It's not butterfingers, sticky fingers. The other one. The opposite of that one. After the duchy made their declaration, the Holy State stopped sh shipping salt. Merchants can no longer trade salt in the capital either. Well, that's not good. Came here open to bring my aunt to live with me in the capital. This boss invasion took me by surprise, but life's been easier since. I enjoy freedom of trade and no longer have to give offerings to the crown. Hmm. These guys were sent to the capital, returned not a moment ago. The preparations are continuing apace, pace. So worry about sharing the field with the Hyzantian troops. And deal with it. Our soldiers look like they're preparing for something. There's another big battle on the horizon. Zanzid soldiers that were bringing relief supplies look like they're ready for war, too. Our reserves are still stocked. Don't know how long that'll last. Dutchie's trade embargo is me worried, to say the least. All right, then. Do their slavery, but now, you know, it's a good point. Now one of the saints, they'll help me retake Glenbrook. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> and a commission for like a few months, and Sarah immediately becomes saint of the nation, and Simone protected the result from. Yeah, I don't want to. Yeah, yeah, there's. Mm. This is not good. All right. I'll tell you what we're going to do here. Uh, I've been going about two hours. I'm going to probably actually cut the stream here for today. I'm still. <sighs> I'm just very tired, and I'm not, like, having optimal stream energy. Um, so, as much as I want to keep going, I don't want to, like... I feel like I'm just going to fan out pretty quickly here. Uh, just because... I, I it's been a rough week, sleep-wise. You know how it is. So, I think what we'll do is we'll call it here. I'll say thank you all very much for coming. Hope you enjoyed Butterfly Soup Toop. Uh, there will be a new episode, not a new episode, but uh, if you hadn't been here earlier, our Umineko post-mortem will be up tomorrow, um, where we go over all the questions everyone asked us, uh, and also talk about the future of R07 on the channel, so please look forward to that. Um, please always recommend me Yuri. I, like, just, just, just recommend that shit to me, I, I, I'll find a place for it. Uh, and that's all I got for you, I hope you all have a wonderful day. Bye.